Okay, this video is for um, 805 Road King. Uh, we found this in our garage. And this might be useful to you. This is a Coleman. And that's the spec on there. Pretty much uh, similar to what you have there. Uh, the serial numbers on here. And it is a Tecumseh. Uh, you can see the logo is still there. Um, although this is Coleman, so they painted green. But you can see the um, gas tank is pretty much the same way. Um, and then the spec on this. I'm going to show it to you. Okay. That's a spec on it. Hope that would help you a little bit more on your engine right there. Um, you also question about the muffler. Uh, this is, I believe, this is the original muffler, the one you have on your video there. I believe it's um, it's a remake, and I've seen that on um, on the John Deere seventy, uh, sixty, seventy, and. 100 and 101 people use on that but I've seen them on the 70 versions um, of the John Deere so you can put that because this is the same this is the same neck and everything um, pretty much this is the same uh, uh, carburetor and you also mentioned about the two holes here uh, the two hole here is actually for a guard um there was on the uh on the um on lawnmower they had these on a guard uh, i remember that on this uh on one of our um well it's right now it's in storage but i can probably pull it out in the summer um that's the air filter there instead of yours has uh went upward um there's a, that's another version too. You can actually stick that on to that as well. But this is the side one right here. Um, that one, the one that goes upward from here, from where you are. That's that's um, that's the air. Um, I have that somewhere in the um, in the old uh, John Deere. I believe the John Deere's uh, John Deere the the the, the seventy something version. Uh, 77 or I don't know what uh, I have it downstairs I should just go down there and pick it up but anyway I'm just lazy sorry um, pretty much the same way as you can see where your the gas uh, tank where you have your gas tank I'm gonna lift it up a little bit and help you out a little bit here Ugh. see right there that's um, they didn't have anything there absolutely nothing it just goes right into it this one is actually green instead but I didn't have like a shut off valve or anything although it should be put on a shut off valve <clears throat> but yeah that's the same this is the same thing as yours uh, the air filter and take the air filter it's actually on this one is on the side but uh, I think the one you have is um it's not the original, that's for sure. Um, because I can see that they, I believe they they took that off from maybe like an early version of it. Um, of the same motor, because they, they actually have different. That's the old air filter. That's the old one right there, as you can see. And then all they did was they took these two out, and then that would line up and it stays up here instead so it, it, so someone actually redone that that's for sure as you as you mentioned in the video that is not the original but anyway um i hope this video helped you a little bit out um especially um what we think it is um i've seen the breather holes over here it's kind of oily and make sure to check the oil because this one is kind of sits around for a while um 
it says to use uh, 30 um, SAE oil only so make sure to use that on yours if you decided to do it and it says uh, important check engine oil level every five hours of operation um, but anyway it's a cut to cut to comesy that's for sure oh well it's I believe isn't that like owned by um by uh owned by um uh Brigham Stratton later I think that that also did happen Brigham Stratton bought it but anyway um that's the model on that and hope you can pause it and find that I believe it's the same thing. It's just that uh, Coleman made it and they painted green instead. So I hope that's the spec, and I hope that will be help you helpful to you. But that's um, that's what I got for you.